So more than 50 years after the Beatles broke up, they have a brand new single. How is this possible when George Harrison and John Lennon are no longer alive? Well, thanks to some technology created by director Peter Jackson, he and his team were able to use technology to separate a vocal and piano track on a cassette tape. Previously, the track was sort of worked on for the anthology series that they put out in 1995. During those sessions, the three remaining Beatles at the time were able to create two songs. The final John Lennon demo was not usable until now. Jackson was even asked to create the music video for this song, and he really didn't want to. Paul and Ringo had to convince him that there was enough footage for him to use so that he could make a fitting tribute and essentially a goodbye for the band. Now and Then truly is the final Beatles song. It has all four of them. Brand new mixed vocals by John Lennon, a guitar part by George Harrison, harmonies by Paul McCartney and Ringo Starr, and of course their bass playing and their drumming. Make sure you check out the 12 minute documentary of the same name that explains how the project came together. So what do you think of the new track? Does it feel like a Beatles song or does it feel like a bad goodbye? 